First off, how did how was the first year as a you know Wisconsin assistant coach, you know, on the recruiting trail and whatnot, and, and just how did you have to adapt or whatnot to you know to being in a new school? Um, I, I really enjoyed my first year. Um, I was telling telling uh, some of the other guys that really helped already coaching under Coach Chris and being familiar with some of the coaches that's on staff. So it allowed the transition, my transition to be pretty smooth. Um, you know, it's, it's always great when you have guys that are coachable and want to grow and want to learn and get better. And I feel like I had that type of room. They always wanted to uh, spend a lot of time with me. Uh, so that helped. And then uh, just on the recruiting trail, uh, coming here, I already had uh, some guys that I was already communicating with, um, as well as some of the guys that was already here. But you know, just a lot of the things that I learned throughout uh, over the years of, of recruiting really, really helped me to get the guys that we have uh, signed today. I said, with Austin, but with two of them, with with, with a Corey, what what stands out about his game and what he'll bring to that cornerback room as a, especially as a mid-year enrollee? Right. So I. And, and, Corey is a guy that I was talking to while I was at Toledo. And uh, the things that I saw in his tape was that he was a really athletic uh, guy who played multiple positions. He played on the offensive side of the ball as a wide receiver, uh, was in the return game as a returner, as well as a corner. So all those uh, skill set, uh, playing on the offensive side of the ball with good ball skills, uh, getting a chance to see him in the return game and run after the catch. I feel like those uh, that skill set can tra transition over to corner when you make plays, being able to get interceptions and change the game. You know, so I like that that out of him. And last one for you, because I know that I think Brian told me it's time. Uh, Avion Jones, just I know it's not to Jim about his versatility, but how do you feel he could he could be used on, in the defensive backfield? Yeah, just just like you said, versatility, uh, very smart. Uh, did uh, his. his his, his school did a great job of preparing him for college. Uh, really smart, has a high football IQ, a guy that uh, communicates to the front, set in front, communicating in the back end. Uh, so that that football IQ and versatility, you know, we can do a lot of different things with him. I, mean, I like his explosiveness. You know, when that ball's in the air, he's attacking. He really can jump. Uh, just, just, just love how he plays fast, plays smart, love the game, and, and uh, does a lot of good things for his program, and I think that can carry over here. Really good leader. Awesome. Thank you so much, Hank. I really appreciate your time. Okay.